Well, today we saw Cindy McLaughlin Lavrone break her own world record once again in the women's 400 meter hurdles, winning the gold and successfully defending her title. It's been 40 years since this event debuted at the Olympics, and the first in the long line of champions was an Iowa State Cyclone. In 1983, Nawal L. Matawakel received an athletic scholarship to attend Iowa State. There, she ran cross country before transitioning to the 400 meter hurdles. She achieved success pretty quickly, winning a national title in that event the following year and placing fourth in the 400. That summer, Nawal would go on to make history for the sport and for her country. Her dream of competing at the Olympics was now a reality. She was competing in the inaugural women's 400 meter hurdles at the 1984 Olympics in Los Angeles. In the most important 54 seconds of her career, at just 22 years old, Nawal etched her name in history by capturing Olympic gold, the first ever of the event and the first for her home country of Morocco. She also became the first Arab, African and Muslim woman to win Olympic gold. She retired at the young age of 25, but wanted to continue empowering women in her country and around the world. Nawal went on to become the Minister of Sports in Morocco and Vice President of the International Olympic Committee. Winning the gold changed her life and put her on track to a greater purpose, to inspire and empower. And Nawal is a true trailblazer. She's still an active member of the IOC, and she was inducted into the Iowa State Athletics Hall of Fame in 1997. Stephanie?